My name is Christina Curtis and I'm faculty at Stanford University in the School of Medicine, Division of Oncology, as well as in the Department of Genetics. Along with my co-chairs Anil Rustigi, Joanna Bendel, Hans Clevers, and Owen Sampson, I believe that we've really put together an exciting program that spans the basic science through genomic discoveries and clinical translation that um, should be quite impactful for many in this area, and I'm certainly excited about the science that will be presented. You know, there have been so many advances in recent years that really span from the very basic science um, all the way to the clinical translational, and I think it's very timely to be holding this meeting to bring together researchers across the, the world um, to convene on this, so it's, it's ripe. We have topics ranging from basic science and models of intestinal stem cells, for example, organoid technology, all the way up to genomics and developing improved biomarkers for patient stratification. And then we're bringing in some of the leading experts on clinical trials in this area to really set the stage for how we can think about advancing cures as well. I think you will hear quite a bit about immunotherapy in the context of colon cancer, as well as interactions between um, the tumor immune microenvironment and the host microbiota. And I think these have been recent advances. I'm sure there's more to come in the year ahead. We're learning a lot about how these tumors evolve, evade response to therapy, and in some cases can be sensitized. And what are the specific molecular characteristics of a given patient's tumor that, that might afford that? And so this is clearly gonna be important for, for translation. I'm very excited about the use of organoid technology and some of the folks that have pioneered this, including Hans Clevers, who's a co-chair of the meeting, um, will be speaking to that as well as others, how we can use these models to look at both disease initiation as well as therapeutics. Um, I'm also excited about some of the new trials that are emerging, opportunities for immunotherapy and technology to, for example, monitor minimal residual disease. It's nice to bring together experts across all areas of this field and to give them an opportunity, one, to really learn what's going on in different spaces in one place, um, but also to have the opportunity to network, to present on their work, and um, hear what's up and coming. Thank you.